Israeli scholars have pieced together and deciphered one of two previously unread manuscripts of the Dead Sea Scrolls more than half a century since their discovery. The 60 or more tiny fragments of parchment bearing encrypted Hebrew writing had previously been thought to come from a variety of different scrolls. But now academics have found the pieces all fit together to make just one scroll. The document makes reference to a unique 364-day calendar and a festival that marks the changing of the season celebrated by an ancient, celibate Jewish sect. Scroll down for video. The Dead Sea Scrolls have fascinated scholars and historians since the ancient texts were found around 70 years ago scattered within a series of caves in the West Bank. Eshbel Ratson and Jonathan Bentov from the University of Haifa's Bible Studies Department found the pieces all fit together after they started examining them just under a year ago. Some of the fragments they had to decipher were smaller than 1 square centimeter, 0.15 inch squared. They put it all together and said it was actually one scroll, said Elon Yadelberg a university spokesman. A Haifa University statement said that Ratson and Bentov were now working on deciphering the last remaining scroll. Many experts believe the manuscripts of the Dead Sea were written by the Salabite Essenes, a dissident Jewish sect that had retreated into the Judean desert around Qimran and its caves. The theory says the group either wrote the Dead Sea Scrolls or were caretakers of the legal, philosophical and religious documents. The latest deciphered scroll contains references to the 364-day calendar used by the sect, as opposed to the lunar calendar used in Jewish religious practice today. The scroll also identifies the name of a festival that celebrates the changing of the seasons. The festivals included new wheat, new wine, and new oil which are related to the Jewish festival Shave Out and no longer observed in Judaism, writes BBC. Researchers also identified a festival observed four times a year called Tekufa, which means period in modern-day Hebrew and marks the transition between the seasons. The parchment and papyrus scrolls contain Hebrew, Greek and Aramaic writing and include several of the earliest known texts from the Bible, including the oldest surviving copy of the Ten Commandments. The scroll also has annotations in the margin from a scribe correcting the author's original work. Thought to have been written between 200 BC and 100 AD, the documents inscribe some of the oldest known foundations of the Old Testament. Despite experts citing the texts as among the biggest archaeological finds of the 20th century, their origins and authorship have remained a mystery for decades. Numbering around 900, they were discovered between 1947 and 1956 in the Qumran caves above the Dead Sea, 